So how are we doing? Tired yet? No, of course not. We've got only two questions to go. Number 54. For all numbers that are a multiple of 6 and less than or equal to 100, what fraction of them are also divisible by 8? All right. Well, what we're really looking for is how to set up what works out of the total number of possibilities. So first, we're going to have to figure out how many different numbers are in play at all. So we've got 100 numbers. We're looking for them to be a multiple of 6. So if we divide 100 by 6, we get 16.6 repeating numbers. That's weird. What does the 0.6 mean? That actually means that there are only 16 numbers that really work. There's no 0.6 number that we're looking for. What are those 16 numbers? If you were confused by the division, not a big deal. You know how to multiply by 6. So I've got a 6, a 12, an 18, a 24, all the way up to 96. You can physically write this out and come up with the same 16 numbers. So now out of our 16 numbers, how many of them are divisible by 8? We've got 4, 24, 48, 72, and 96. So the fraction we're looking for is 4 out of 16. Don't be worried that you don't see 4 out of 16 as an answer choice though. Why? Because if we reduce 4 out of 16, we get 1 over 4. The answer is G.